Welcome back, everybody, for our second-to-last Regendra scenario and second-to-last scenario in all of Dynasties of India. Let's go into Sacred Waters. I was reminded the other oh, day that's a big a snake. that I had nearly forgotten. The tale of the god Indra and his battle against the mighty serpent, Vitra. The Vitra had taken all of the rivers of the world hostage, causing a global drought. Only by destroying the 99 fortresses of the Vitra and slaying the beast itself was Indra able to liberate the waters. The priests would call me sacrilegious, but to me, this tale has a hidden meaning. I am facing a Vitra of my own, and that monster is the great lie that I have lived until this day. The 99 fortresses are the little lies that are still burrowed into my soul. My irrational fear of corruption, my distaste for violence, and that misplaced care for the so-called innocent. Only when I destroy these inner fortresses can I unleash the greatness within me and become a ruler whose name will live on for millennia. To do so, I must look beyond our traditional enemies. Far to the northeast lies the land of Bengal. It is here where the sacred Ganges meets the ocean that I will achieve my greatest triumph yet. I have announced a march on the Pala Empire that rules Bengal. General Arayan has already left at the head of a large vanguard. Together, we will bring holy water from the Ganges back to Cholalands, so that the gods may bless our realm. And if I can defeat one of the greatest empires in the known world in the process, then all the better. And we join the dark side of the force. Now, there is another achievable in this scenario, aka achievement. And we have to win before uh, Mahipala completes his wonder. Now, I don't know how long that's going to be, but we're going to do our best to act quickly. Rendezvous with General Arayan near the Bengali army's camp. Okay, we can do that. Bring Regendra to conquer their allied cities to gain control of their production buildings. As long as you have food stockpiled, your soldiers will regenerate HP if you taunt 110 for a cost of... Oh, interesting. Improve army morale by using heroes in combat. This takes in the form of... Okay, that's normal. Regendra begins in the Imperial Age with a pop limit of 200, but does not require houses to maintain, but can not construct any slow-moving siege weapons except for armored elephants before reaching General Arayan. You have no economy of your own in this mission and cannot train economic units such as villagers or fishing ships, nor trade cogs or transport ships. Instead, you will receive resources from your allies in Vengi, as well as the towns that you conquer uh, on your way to Bengal. To win, you must strike a balance between restraint and expediency. Rushing ahead to defeat Mahipala before his army reaches its full strength and his wonder is completed could stretch out your supply lines, but advancing slowly will allow the Bengalis to fully build up, making the final battle harder to win. Raiding the countryside and completing side quests will slow down your march, but the resources and otherwise inaccessible technologies that they could provide uh, are they're better later on. Yeah. The Mahipala's economic buildings lie on the banks of the Ganges, making them vulnerable to naval raids. Uh, Rajendra's army has arrived in the allied town of Vengi. Uh, you'll be able to augment your starting forces here, but you cannot linger uh, before you have to march towards Bengal. Kalinga is close to Vengi, and its defenses are comparatively weak. They have stuff. Beyond Kalinga is the heavily fortified city of Utkala, oh yeah, from the first Devapala scenario, whose walls could prove too great a challenge for a head-on assault. Uh, it'll defend itself with stuff. At the end of the road lies the Pala Empire, ruled by the great Bengali Empire Maha Emperor Mahapala, uh, who has made his camp on the uh, banks of the Ganges and will have a bunch of stuff. General Arayan, a veteran from the campaign against the Chalukyan Empire, has established a forward camp near the Bengali position where he awaits your arrival. Scattered throughout the countryside are local villages that are prime targets for raiding. You may also run into packs of bandits, but these should be no match for your army. Okay. The journey ahead okay, I got a big... Long, seems like an interesting scenario. Take heart, men. Once the Bengali emperor lies dead in the field, you will all drink from the sacred river Ganges. Yeah. We are running low on provisions for our soldiers and bread. Might I suggest a quick romp through the countryside for a bit of pillaging? Uh, nice little romp. The have excellent food stores at this time of year. Okay. The 
Here is General Arrayan with his army arrayed. Oh god, okay, they just... Okay, um... Do you truly believe that your army of fledglings can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Fala Empire? Uh, uh, maybe. If we believe hard enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The kingdom of Kalinga is the first obstacle in our path. Many of their soldiers are spread out Um... So the city should be easy to get. <laughs> Lee, everybody, run for your lives. Uh. Okay, so I guess we'll lose control of these production buildings, but I think we'll get them over here in uh, Kalinga. Oh, okay. Before we continue our march. Okay, let's take down that. It appears that King Indradatta fled as soon as he saw our forces on the horizon. The coward! Oh, let's deal with that. If we kill him, we could crush what little remains of the resistance. Okay, siege elephants are going to be real slow. That you have captured Kalinga, Oh, feels bad, man. But you do not hear me bragging about it. Until right now, when you're clearly bragging about it. The ship filled with resources has arrived from Tanjavur. Okay. Make sure that it reaches our army unscathed. I guess we do that. We have no blacksmith, notably. Perhaps we can find an easier way inside. Oh, 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 oh. Kill the people in the other village over there. There's more food than we do. Feels bad, man. Oh, hey, it's the Ukala woman. Okay. Some Alita Rumi. Okay, I guess we have to go after these guys. Let's get rid of Kalinga as fast as possible. How's that wonder coming along? Okay. Well, that's not so great. Oh yeah, once we get this food, we're gonna do that. Yeah, that's that's a pretty cool mechanic. Okay, um there's King Indraratha. Uh I think if we right click units, we're able to like Phase through enemy units better? Okay, we're gonna go for the old sniper Reno. Uh, allies? Yes. Okay. Oh, feels bad, man. They must be acted upon. A brave death does not undo a life of cowardice. Ring archer armor and bracer researched. Okay. That's pretty dope. Okay, um, let's keep going though. Gotta, gotta keep go, 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 go. Hit the target. Flash bang through the door. Just like Captain Price tells us. Ah! What is my freaking armored elephant? I can bait more army outside. Get some more Therasada, I suppose. Oh, 
Go, kill him. Kill him. Kill him now. Ah! Okay. Now I can bring these guys up to the front. Let's heal ourselves, because that sounds pretty OP. Uh, maybe we can defeat their army, then we just get control of their stuff. Resources has arrived from Tanjabur. Make sure that it reaches our army on scale. Up. Oh. Go get those guys. Um. Is ours. Nice. But we cannot stay here for long. Reinforce our army and let us face the Bengali Emperor in battle. Oh god, god. Ugh. Some weeks ago, bandits stole a relic from our monastery. As our new ruler, we Sorry, ask that you return it. To us. Okay. Oh my god, that is going fast. Okay, we have to go, go, go. Um, let not the swift wait for the slow. It is good to see you again, Rajendra. Now, oh. Mahipala has arrayed his army on the battlefield and prepares to attack. My men and I have scouted the land thoroughly, however, so we will not have to fight behind you. Okay, guess we go this way. When this day is over, we will wash up the blood of our enemies in the sacred waters of the Ganges. Okay, have to go, 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 go. Can have you guys take out that. You guys, well, I guess we'll array over here. Oh man, this is gonna be tough. Oh my goodness. Ah! I hope there's not anything really in between here in the way or whatever. My dynasty learned not to embark on extravagant campaigns like yours. Oh god. The rubies are fast. Oh, can we debate them? Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. No. Oh my god, they have so many vills. No. No, no. Damn it! 16 minutes! Oh my goodness! We have to go way fast! The journey ahead of us will be long and arduous. Take heart, men. Once the Bengali Emperor lies dead in the field, you will all drink from the sacred river Ganges. We are running low on provisions for our soldiers. Might I suggest a quick romp through the countryside for a bit of pillaging? The peasantry have excellent food stores at this time of year. Okay, so we have to go way faster. 
Actually, we don't need to go that much faster. Many of their soldiers are spread out across the countryside, so the city should be easy to get. I hear rumors of a vast Jola force marching on. Do you truly believe that your army of fledgling can go toe to toe with the Fala Empire? It did not work out too well for your predecessors. Run away! Come on. Go, go, go! Kalinga is ours. Let us rest and bandage our wounds before we continue our march. Go get that. King Indrarata fled as soon as he saw our forces on the horizon. He now hides in a small fortress in the mountains and plans to attack us from behind once we leave the city. If we kill him, we could crush what little remains of the resistance. Okay, have our non-elephant units go on this uh, little expedition to get King Indrapura. Or Indraratha, Indrapura's in Vietnam. I do stepped on an ant this morning, Okay, so I think if we just make ourselves a little bit more efficient, I think we should be alright. A ship filled with resources has arrived from Tanjavur. Make sure that it reaches our army unscathed. Just do everything a bit more efficiently. Heal up. Oh, um, let's go ahead and get you over here. What? Oh, okay. We'll get you on the way back. Okay, the running in here and just trying to snipe them. That, that was a good idea. I literally did it like last week. Just saying. It would have been a fine thing. To burn Tanjavur to the ground. Strong words for a man with an arrow through his chest. But for such words to have any meaning, they must be acted upon. A brave death does not undo a life of darkness. Um. Let's just send these seven champions to go take this one down. That way everyone else is, uh, keep on keeping on. Oh my god, a mosquito! I don't have time for you, mosquito! Okay, hopefully then we can take, uh, Utkala faster. But we should definitely use, like, the healing thing as much as we can, because that's pretty insane. Okay, so 16 minutes is our benchmark. 
Awesome. We cannot stay here for long. Reinforce our army and let us face the Bengali Emperor in battle. Some weeks ago. Yeah, uh, we should also get that one. Uh, maybe we can get that one with these reinforcements. It's good to see you again, Rajendra. Now, Mahipala has arrayed his army on the battlefield and prepares to attack. My men and I have scouted the land thoroughly, however, so we will not have to fight blindly. A ship filled with resources has arrived from Punjabi. Make sure that it reaches our army unscathed. We must hurry. Okay, we got ten armored elephants. When this day is over, we will wash out the blood of our enemies in the sacred waters of the Ganges. Sounds like fun on a bun. Wait, what? Oh! Use them to crack open Utkala's defenses. Get that one, I guess. Oh, wait, General Aaron. Arian, whatever. Okay, um Okay, we're we're getting close. Still have a little bit of time, but we're we're getting close. My dynasty learned not to embark on extravagant campaigns like yours long ago. Now we will teach the Jolas the same lesson. With our fully operational battle station. But I must remember that these peasants are not truly innocent. In their weakness, they allow themselves to be used by an enemy king. They are as complicit in the slaying of my soldiers as he is. I don't think that's how that one works. Okay, get the wonder. I think we win if we get the wonder. I think that's how that works. I hope that's how that works. Oh, damn it. Just get me bandaged up, and I will be back on the front lines in no time. Okay, let's just try and snipe this wonder. Oh, that didn't go so well. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's just see what kind of defenses we can mount here. You've got to be kidding me. Oh my god. Oh, this is a tough one, guys. Ugh, I need a big glorp of water. The journey ahead of us will be long and Once the Bengali Emperor lies dead in the field, we will all drink from the sacred river Ganges. We are running low on provisions for our soldiers. Okay, so what was our mistake there? I feel like our elephants were too slow behind the rest of our units. Many of their soldiers are spread out across the countryside, so the city should be easy pickings. Lock the gates! Abandon your posts! I 
The other one. <laughs> Oh, come on. Hey, what's that? It's a hut. Come on, come on, come on, come on. The linger is ours. Let us rest and bandage our wounds before we continue our march. It appears that King Indrarata fled as soon as he saw our forces on the horizon. He now hides in a small fortress in the mountains and plans to attack us from behind once we leave the city. If we kill him, we could crush what little remains of the resistance. I hear that you have captured Kalinga, Legenda. I too stepped on an ant this morning, you know. But you do not hear me bragging. Yeah. Spare us. Kill the people in the other village over there. They have more food than we do. A ship filled with resources has arrived from Punjabur. Make sure that it reaches our army. Go, go. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh god. Utkala lies before us. Its thick walls and dense forests are formidable defenses. Perhaps we can find an easier way. The walls of Utkala have not been breached in living years, and they will not go to the east. Okay, now run away! I only regret is not joining the Chalukyas in war against you, Rajendra. It would have been a fine thing. To burn Tanjabu to the ground. Strong words for a man with an arrow through his chest. But for such words to have any meaning, they must be acted upon. Brave death does not undo a life of cowardice. Okay. Get some more Therasadai. Lots of multitasking in this one. I'm just having to, you know, go, go, go. Okay, maybe you can bait out some more of their army. Oh, maybe we can sneak their our, our own army in. Oh, this would be a big win. This, I think, would be a big win. Nice. Let's 
Some weeks ago, bandits stole a relic from our monastery. As our new ruler, we ask. It is good to see you again, Rajendra. Now, Mahipala has arrayed his army on the battlefield and prepares to attack. Okay, let's have these guys go that way. And I have scouted the land thoroughly, however, so we will not have to fight blindly. Wash up the blood of our enemies in the sacred waters of the Ganges. A ship filled with resources has arrived from Tanjabu. Make sure that it reaches our army unscathed. Okay, keep go, go, go on. Okay. You can go over this way. No. Twelve minutes. That's pretty good. Okay, I think we're in a way better spot than we were. Okay, maybe we can fight their army a little bit even. Okay, only a little bit. <laughs> Still anxious. I mean, it's like even disrupting this is going to be huge. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay, uh, let's keep our heroes actually way back over here. Let's go get that wonder. Oh, yeah, whatever happened to this place? Did I, like... Oh! Here's the relic cart. Holy artifacts. Ah, well. As long as they reward us for our trouble. Yes! Did it! Um... Oh. Wait, we need to destroy their castles. Oh. Um... Okay, now we, now we rebuild our army. Hopefully we can at least get back over this way. Because, yeah, these guys are all totally dead. Maybe they can snipe some production buildings. Oh, yeah, the Trebs. Let us use them to crack open Utkala's defenses. Oh, wait, I can go this way. They'll take damage while in use. Okay, I didn't catch that before. Anyway, we're making a big old army of stuff. See what we get for bringing the relic back. Kalinka and Ukala are paying us, but I think we're in the clear. We humbly thank you for your help, Emperor Agenda. You may have your pick from our supply stores. Chemistry and cannon galleon. All right. Well, right now, we just kind of need to rebuild. A ship filled with resources has arrived from Tanjabu. Make sure that it reaches our army unscathed. Sorry. Um... Wish we could have 
you know, Utkala and Kalinga working at the same time. Oh man, but that is a tough, tough achievement, guys. Wait a minute, can I just go to Utkala now, where they have more production? Oh, I mean, I lose all these units in the queue, but I, all, I can just requeue them. But yeah, these guys have like two archery ranges. And I want an army of mostly elephant archers, I think. Just some like Halbs and Arumi in front. Oh, we have fast fire ship. Thanks for the resources, kiddos. Maybe we can sneak out some units and take down that market. I guess Utkala doesn't have a dock. All right. All right, all right, all right. Oh, now we can make more trebuchets. Oh yeah, this production's so much better. Okay, well now they're launching an attack and they're, they are launching an attack against us, if I can talk. Yeah, now our elephant archers and whatnot are fully upgraded. Oh, I don't have a market. Crap, I lost the market that's, like, over here. So now I need to go all the way back to... Uh, Kalinga. Anyway, you guys are doing decently well. I just need to buy a ton of food. Ungulsitum. Okay, so we can't get Blast Furnace. Unless there's something that I missed. Oh no, that is Utkala's dock. Let's get guilds. Okay, we don't have much of an army still. And they are elite cannon galleons. Ooh. That the hot my hotkey doesn't work for some reason. That's super weird. With resources has arrived from Tanjavo. Make sure that it reaches our army unscathed. Alright. Oh, come on now. Whip it good. Phew, this is an intense one. I, I mean, I really like this scenario. It's obviously super different from the last one. I'm pretty sure that's not how that works. Like, I am reasonably confident that that's not how that works.
Yeah, we're already 40 minutes into this video, even though the scenario itself is super short. Oh man, but that like initial rush to get to the wonder. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, where's... Oh my god. Oh, I do not have many Thirasadai left. They do have some more docks over this way. Anyway, our Dravidian Ellie archers are now doing work. Um, well, it's still a little scary. NGL. Okay, um, let's retreat. We really need to do our best to preserve Ellie Archer numbers. Those are going to be our only decently efficient option here. But at least we should be able to take on a lot of their production buildings and their economy, I guess they were saying in like the hints and whatever. My god, heated shots OP. Go, go, Dravidian Ellie Archers! Ungurzitum! A ship filled with resources has arrived from Panjabu. Make sure that it reaches our army unscathed. Oh my god, they have ships that just spawn outside the map. They got 24 Ellie Archers. Oh yeah, they take damage every time they're fired. Maybe they can take down this castle. I guess that stops some Ratha production. Awesome, we got the castle. Surprised that they survived this one. Go, go, Ellie Archer Micro. Oh, they don't have plus four defense. That seems like a big balancing thing. Oh, I have these ranges as well. I assume all of our trebs aren't rotted through, it's just those ones. We have uh, Elephant Core, right? Or Medical Core? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this is a, another really cool scenario. Stop it, you 
butt face. I apologize for my very coarse language, but sometimes uh, the AI is being a butt face. At least they don't make onagers or anything like that. I mean, we could go right for the castle snipe, but I feel like it's way safer to just kind of slowly grind our way through their base. I mean, we're not in any rush anymore. After the initial part where we were in very much a rush. <laughs> Oh, damn, that's still a big army. Whoa, 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 stop, 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 stop. Get some more Theosad eye. A ship filled with resources has arrived from Tanjabu. Make sure that it reaches our army unscathed. Well, we were at least able to keep most of our elephant archers alive. And that is not without virtue. Keep those cannon galleons over there. Let's have these Therasada able to escort. My god, they go literally all along the coastline. Literally just need to have these ships patrolling back and forth. Anyway, as long as we can snipe some more production buildings along the way. Wait, can you reach that? Hey, what are you guys doing? I don't I don't remember you guys. No. Nah. Yeah, they still have a lot of eco. Yeah, now it looks like we're uh, at least sort of on our victory march. I gotta say, Rajendra's gonna be up there for one of the hardest campaigns in all of AoE, too. I feel like if you're not an experienced campaign player, you're gonna struggle a lot here. But, I mean, like, I love it, of course. Oh, 
March to victory. Yinikatabi. Ungul Sitom. Alright. Eh, yeah, screw it. Let's just go for the castle. I guess even so, this, is, this isn't a super short mission. Because even if you snipe the wonder, it's still, uh... Still pretty long. A ship filled with resources has arrived from Tanjabu. Oh, I think they spawn a couple of galleons every time one of those ships spawn. One of those uh, trade cogs. All right, we did it, guys. Whoo! Whoo! That's a toughie. The Bala army scatters like birds frightened by a tiger's roar. Victory is out. No wonder you won. And that is our last achievement, other than just beating the campaign. So I think this DLC, I was able to do all of the achievements as I was playing through them, which is pretty cool. Despite suffering humiliation at my hands, Mahipala refuses to bend the knee. He retreats and leaves Eastern Bengal open for raids. And in doing so, he saves his dynasty from annihilation. A part of me admires his staunch resistance, but that is a part of me which must die. There can be no admiration for one's enemies. No respect for those who refuse to accept their place in the world that I am creating. For now, I will leave Mahipala to pick up the pieces of his broken pride. Another, even greater predator has drawn my eye. Oh man, is that Srivijaya? Seven forty-eight to four twenty-four. Not too bad. Not too bad. Mahipala, of course, gathering a bunch of resources. They get some tributed from something somewhere. Oh, like the map is literally black, except for a bandit, bandit hanging out like he does in every scenario. In the void. In the darkness. But yeah, fun, fun scenario. You know, very different in how it plays out, but very enjoyable. Anyway, guys, we have one scenario left, and that is slaying the Vritra, Vitra, and we're going to Srivijaya. See you next time for that one.